Hello, in this video I'm going to be showing you one method of removing a larger broken bolt, tap, stud or even drill. What we're going to do is we're going to use this brass hex electrode to spark a hex into the top of the broken bolt which will allow us to get an allen key in there to try and uh, release it up. Uh, what I've done is I've simulated a uh, component here that's got a broken bolt in. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to spark down using this hex electrode about four or five mil to allow me to get my Allen key in to try and release it. It doesn't really matter what condition the end of the uh, the the broken part is. It doesn't need to be flat or smooth. It can be all sorts that it will just spark straight through it. You just may need to give a little bit more depth if it's got a rough finish on the end to allow you to get your Allen key in. Now, uh, what we're going to do here, again, I'm, I'm not going to submerge the part. What I'm going to do is I've just got this uh, flushing nozzle on here. Uh, and I'm going to give it a fresh flow of tap water over the top using this uh, garden pond pump in a bucket. Uh, that allows us just to make sure that we've got that component, fresh water, dielectric going over. Uh, this could be used on a large component in situ uh, to allow you just to get that broken part out. The setup on the generator is really simple. All I've got now is my power stage set to medium and my arc timer set to six seconds. Nothing else really. All I'm going to do is hit start and get going. 